occupy your own hood where these people do it. Claim eminent domain and have your people moving. That's a small glimpse into what Nipsey was doing. But anybody still confused as to what he was doing? The neighbor. Man, I really feel that shit. Rest in peace, Nip, again. I'm around yeah. Pete Nip. We got out the whole, all we not giving everybody the game. We're gonna keep that name and that movement alive as much as we can. Rest in peace, Nip, again. Yeah, but, uh, man. But, man, whole brand, that shit. We did. Killed that shit. That's why he Killed old, that though. That's why he old, though. So we, we back, man. Uh, Definitely. And, and no opinions, you know. We here again. Mm -hmm. Got Poop, we got Gary, we got Dean, you know what I'm saying? Man, stop Free. saying that nigga, man. I gotta shout out my Oh, what? Can I, can I, can I, can I come out? 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 Come Freestyle J Hag on talking about Nip talking about some 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 pretty big things and it's gonna lead right into what we talking about. We here talking about the uh, past ten years. Uh, I don't wanna say the most influential because who's to tell who's <coughs> the most? But we gonna talk about some pretty big influences on on the black community in the past ten years. And you can't talk about influence on the black community without bringing up Jay. Starting so, it off with so I don't know. the block. I mean I don't wanna say number one because for me. I don't wanna say number one because in the past ten when 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 Obama got elected? Two thousand eight. No, it wasn't yeah. eight. I think the second one was eight. But out of the way in the last four ten years, years four years before that? Yeah and 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 out of the way in the last ten years Obama was president. So, president of the goddamn United States, Jay my nigga, and Ben my nigga, but president of, of, of the United States, that, 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 I'm gonna put that at the top. Yeah, but Jay, influence. but that's Jay ain't fall behind. That's some influential shit. Man. Jay, I mean, just, Jay got the stamp from Obama. But Jay got the stamp from Obama, exactly. That's real. Exactly, Obama is the one that's giving out stamps. <laughs> 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 right. The fact of the matter is, Jay influential to us, to our generation. Nigga, my grandma got a picture of Obama on the refrigerator. So it kind of transcends. My grandma ain't, I mean, she probably know who Jay is, but to some people out there, Jay is Beyonce husband. Yeah. And, and I mean, we know we dig deep and, and, and could, could shout out and could see what he's doing, but he's doing a lot for our generation. Like, he yeah. he moving out, like the the, the the culture today's culture for yeah. nigga it, that Obama it, that can't yeah. be touched. People, like, Obama Obama did something that yeah our generation the generation under us and before everybody us, they never thought that they everybody ever everybody so for them for us to be able to witness that you know what I'm saying and for that to be a part of history that's some influential shit yeah I mean like whole whole impact ain't that kind of it's a different it's, type it's of impact. It's a different type of impact because he maximized, he maximized his, yeah. all of his service. It's impact. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a business. Well, we can say, as far as music. You know, music, music, it ain't close. Yeah. It ain't close music. It, it's it impact music. Like, yeah, 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 I don't, want, I don't want to put him in that box. Because, I mean, he started that, but I feel like not his, he, I mean, shit. Yeah, he doing it. He doing it for the culture. Man, they had a cut, and, I mean, I don't know if the Samson shit true, but the man stopped getting haircuts and he just felt like he get strong and strong. Do what I want to. Yeah, he on that. He on that. I mean, but it started from people that he put around him too. Like, I guarantee you, J. Cole had an influence. My homies put J. Cole over. had an influence on hold with that, with that type of movie. I think so. Because I'm telling you, nigga, it started off it with him. It changed. Keep, it keep it started off with him. It That's changed. what he relate to. I'm about to put the people that I put around me, first of all, that I saw the potential in. Right. That I put as another influence. So you think it was a plan? Yeah, it was a plan. Like, I feel like. Yeah, I feel it was like, a plan. Gary, how long has this man been doing? Way. How long has this man been in this process? It's ever since we've known him. Yeah. Ownership. But it, it, the ownership. I mean, maximizing. He definitely, that definitely was it. 
Brand and, name. And we Brand. all know, we all know, like, I was, so, I was right, Jay geez. before, like, a lot of niggas in New Orleans was on Jay, like, that was my nigga. But when niggas was on, say, BG was their uh, favorite nigga, I was on Jay. But, no, yeah, no, we all was on Jay. No, no disrespect. Yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> no disrespect. Yeah, we, 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 but, 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 the he thing is, older. he, he, his <laughs> message different. His message different. Like it's, like it wasn't this much advancement for the people. I feel like it was, it was a, a little more selfish then, which I can understand because shit, I gotta be straight first. But now it, it seemed like he more selfless. And now it seemed like he more for the people than he ever been. And I do think it's some of the, the younger niggas who, who he got around and who opened his eyes to a few things. Yeah, like, but no, I'm just talking about as far as just, as far as the appearance type of level, you know, yeah. what I'm as far as not trying to feel like I got to be for the corporation because I am the corporation now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, yeah. but I feel like, man. Man. you know what I'm saying? But that's what I'm saying. Like, hove, I feel like he been putting in that work because he been keeping the same people around him since he started. So right. at the end of the day, by off of me, maximizing as far as the rap shit, but I still got the mindset to still be this business and build his brand. Everybody that's around me about to eat. Everybody. Still. So at the, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I'm literally putting my pot in the zone too. Everybody that he started off with that started with the rock name. No, you know that's, not that's, true. that's not true. true. That's not true. That's not true. Dame is gone. But Dame still That's the one nigga. Yeah, Dame still that's like they had a whole breakup. That's one that's, that's one, one, one nigga. But Dame still nah, I, and Dame Dame still still that. I guarantee I mean I don't know if he's doing this thing. He, he definitely still doing I don't, I don't, I don't know. I guess doing your thing is relative. Yeah, yeah for sure. But he ain't but nowhere else, near. But who, else, but who else? he came in the game? That's why like came in the game. game for it. Like, he, he put came everybody in. on. Like they got a lot of people too. He started uh, uh, Kevin, look at Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart, another. He, he started his career. He put him in a movie, but. But that was his first yeah, movie. He gave him a big look. That was his first movie. That was his first, that was his first big name. You know what I'm saying? That was his first time being on a big screen. Yeah, I don't know. He it ain't no knock. It, it, it ain't no knock. Like, Kevin like, Hart, you, when he say it was his first movie, he has to say it was soldier. soldier. It's a huge look. It's a huge gap between Dame and Jay. Gap meaning what? For him. For his influence, that's what we're talking about. For his influence, for his cheese, for his everything possible. Oh, but the, the, the gap can't, is huge. Cause Jay tell you, on you a day, say huge. The, the, I can say huge because it's huge. Jay tell you he got some of his game from from. No, from no that. doubt, no doubt, no doubt. You know, what I'm no saying? doubt. He, they definitely brought it in together. Yeah, Dame was the one that that made, or uh, I even say made, but he the one that brought a lot of the people that came to the rock came from him. Came yeah, from Dame. Like all uh, the majority of the people that were signed back in the day with Rockefeller, they that, 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 yeah, that might be true. It ain't no might be that true, Gary. That's but, not true. That's true. But either way, that's and guess what Rockefeller was? was influential. Oh, definitely. And definitely. Dame the one. If you if you if you the, if you the mastermind behind a fucking influential movement, I don't want to say he was. I want to say he was. I ain't taking credit for him. I ain't taking credit for him. Dane was definitely influential back then, and Dane definitely had a, a, a huge role in that. And that's what I'm saying. He's still, he's still, 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 still in that. Rockefeller just as influential with no limit cash money, bad boy. Like these, some of this shit go down in history. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Some of the most influential companies and brands that ever hit the market. Definitely, no doubt. You know what I'm saying? No so, doubt. And I'm, I'm going to tell you how I feel Dane was a big influence, because that uh, we had creative control. So that gave Diddy the idea, I'm going to start Revolt TV. Dame started that first. So I, that's why I say I feel he, that was a big influence, because if it wasn't for Dame, Diddy wouldn't have had the idea to did it, and I did it have the more bread. Know. I don't know. Yeah, Diddy had more bread than back and shit. I don't, I don't know. I don't know if yeah. Diddy got that idea from Dame. Yeah, I don't, man. I don't yeah, I, I can't. I can't say that for what? sure. Like, yeah. I Man, don't want to give Dame his credit. He got credit for Rockefeller, but 
I mean, I did. Yeah, no, within the Rockefeller shit, dang, nigga, he did start a boo cool shit. He did. He started fucking with the, the, the alcohol. Yeah. Nigga started okay, fucking boo-boo. with no, no, everything. No, 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 no. He definitely has culture on the black, on the black. I mean, he definitely has influence on black culture and things of that nature. But we what started out talking about the last 10 years. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But that's what I'm saying. You can't talk he about. He ain't relevant right now. So what Hov did within the past ain't relevant. You just found out. You just found out about the uh, him who he giving back to. Hov been making Hov been making the same moves for the past twenty years. Uh, exactly. So but you he can't still how making you about, them. So that's what I'm saying. You how you so how you about to say that Dame not if he started making them same moves twenty years ago and he's still doing influence right not, now because Dame ain't relevant right now. To you, yeah. to who? He got, he got yes. poo-poo shit on the internet, nigga. Such as, give me an example. No, 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 that nigga got a whole talk show. He got a whole talk show talk right show. now. Now, what's the name of this nigga talk show? This the Dame Dash Channel, bitch. Yeah. Kimmy Kenyatta talk every day. Yeah. Uh, uh, Hip hop motivation. Maybe yeah. I, just, maybe I just don't know. Man wrote a book. Nigga got nigga whole author. Yeah, yeah. He got the book out. I wouldn't fucking. Um, he wouldn't be on culture culture. Yeah, yeah, nigga got yeah. So you can't keep talking about what also, he ain't do. Also, you just also, don't like, you just don't fuck with I ain't gonna say I don't fuck with Dame, but he do a little bit too much clown shit for me. And we all know how I feel about clowns. You know, you yeah, know you how I feel about like clowns. Though. I do not. But if you listen to that, with, if you listen to hip hop motivation, Dame is saying the same thing Jay was just saying in the rap. Yeah, maybe it's his approach. Hey, and fuck Jay. Maybe it's his approach. Maybe he has a clownish approach. Yeah, but which he is why he I can't. He just don't care. I can't yeah. get past the approach. Maybe that's it. For me. But Dame message. Been the message. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, be, he be having some good messages. I ain't gonna even lie. Even cause even the the, the, the Breakfast Club interview. He was saying some real shit. He was saying he some was real shit. Saying he, he, wasn't wasn't saying saying he was saying right He was in full fledged clown yeah, mode. He wasn't saying it the so right way. It, when you in, I guess I'm that. I'm, I guess I'm I'm a victim of when when you in full fledged clown mode. I'm a mission message. I'm a mission message. But he has. I mean, he said some good shit. I mean, yeah, even Charlamagne like, man came back and said he had to call him like, yeah, damn, damn, you was right, man. You was right about some shit, yeah. but how you do it matters too. And yeah. even about Charlamagne, now, now that you said that name, that's another influential person, and I feel like that whole movement that's well, already the best of the, the rap stuff. That's that's some that's some influential shit. Yeah, and whether you think it is or not. Yeah, yeah. You, whether you agree with his approach and how he. Say certain things at right. a lot of times. Right. Yeah, okay. He you know what I'm saying? Because yeah. you could you could say a lot of shit. He says clown shit too. Definitely. But the but main the frame, the main frame, and the main focus. Nevertheless, he definitely. give you that, and he still also give you yeah, another the one. real. Yeah, another one. You know what I'm saying? The, the real perspective on shit. Yeah, yeah he, he, put he, he, he put everybody on. He put a lot of people on. He gave he gave you he gave you a real perspective. I I do I do like that about it. And see, that's the thing. Like, you know. I guess somebody have to start taking it easy on some of these clowns over here, or people I stamp as clowns. We got to, because you got first of all, you got to just define your definition of clown. Because nigga might call, nigga might look at this shit and call you a clown. I was just about to say that. <laughs> you heard me? Because somebody fit clown. Because <laughs> somebody, because somebody, the, the most clownish nigga on that call that another nigga a clown. clown. Some nigga called Pac a clown. That's that's. <laughs> that, I know a nigga called me a clown for that. For sure. For the Pac shit. Niggas called us clown for letting you call yeah, Pac a clown. Yeah, yeah, good. I got that. I'm glad. Fuck. Tell him call me. Yeah. Cause the nigga I'm trying to be more for. <laughs> but but either <laughs> way, you right. I probably do go a little bit too hard with that. That might be something I have to uh fuck it, the niggas be clowns. <laughs> fuck it. Uh, uh well but you I'm back to Obama. Back to Obama. He at the top though. My president is black. Like, uh, like, did a nigga ever feel like, like, I ain't think that shit was possible, dog. That, that was cool. But I feel like you. Nigga said that. But look how a nigga said that was cool. Because that shit is cool. Like, I, I, I feel like the president shit, like, that shit don't even matter to me that much for me to really put that as the most influential shit to me. I feel like it was a good look for the youth. Well, you know what I'm saying? For, as far as the kids to have yeah, it. was a for them. Like, for them to feel like it's a chance if that's what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, me, I feel like a president don't impact the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, how he even, even impact the country the way 
they think or the, the job title say that it might should. Right. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I feel like it's it's kind of like whomever in office, whether you, whatever you are, you know what I'm saying, you're just a, a figure. Yeah, you, you definitely, you definitely still can. Be who you, whatever your values may be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, are, you, you, don't have, you don't have ultimate control to move and shape how you want to move and shape. But just based off influence, like, like, the fact of the matter is that's the highest position in the country. And, that's and for a black that. man to hold it, like, but that's why like I feel what like, you can't do now. But that's why I feel like that's still a, it's still, it's all perspective. Yeah. It's still going in perspective just because how you feel like it's the highest thing for a black man to do as far as just in the country, I still feel like it ain't because you still being controlled. First of all, you look at I mean, it's checks and balances. You look at it. You, you look at the president's salary. Got niggas, niggas in the league yeah, making more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. It ain't, but it ain't. It, it, oh, ain't, yeah. it ain't. It ain't about the money, dog. Because the fact. What's the, the so? What's the true position? Is you all, control the that, army? That's that's yeah. Nigga, you got control of the butt. That's cool with me. And he still was that's getting told because all they all they do is base that shit. He still getting told Man, and look. You control the butt. What's the butt? The butt. I don't want this shit going on no more. <laughs> the butt. And that's cool. You, know, <laughs> you think that's cool? I got ultimate control, but you think that's cool? It is. Like, yeah, that's cool. That's so, what you need the button for. Like, why should you even need the button? Definitely need the button. They got fucking nuclear warfare and nuclear missiles and shit. Why? Bitch, I control all that shit. Because other niggas got it. No, we I control had, out. We probably had it first. That's the whole I point. doubt it. I doubt if we, doubt if we had them first. We know. Just because we, we ain't got, we got the, the biggest we, army. Yeah, we did. Our, we our intelligence ain't the most. So we ain't got the most intelligence. So well, I we definitely got, we feel got it. We got, we got it, but I feel, definitely be feeling like a lot of these other places might be more, uh, might be smarter and a bit more innovative. But For sure. Mean, that's why we get everything that we got from them. Exactly. So that's why I feel like what we need a button from it, we make it, we in cheap. We in debt with everybody. We, everything that we I mean, that's a whole other. nother. That's so a that's whole nother. Yeah, for sure. So that's my, but so, that's my whole outlook on the president as far as job or position. First of all, I feel like you, you know me. We ain't supposed to have jobs. Like, we ain't supposed to have something that we have to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, how you it ain't to eat, food? You want to grow your own food? Wait, what? You want to grow your own food? Yeah, they got enough. Yeah. Dang, I'm growing anything. I need a job that's so I can buy that shit. And that's why you're a part of this fucking fat, lazy society culture. That's Tide, like, dog. Like, every nigga called everything tied. They don't want to do that. But you know why? Because of your job. Most of the time that niggas feel like they tired from doing shit, that they ain't got time to do shit, is because of the job that they have to go to. Uh, mm -hmm. Ain't no mm -hmm. yeah. It's the reason, nigga. Yeah. You can't just go yeah. to yeah. L.A. You, don't you just like can't go to L.A. in yeah. the morning. Bitch, I gotta go to work. You gotta I gotta go to the you job. Don't like I what you got doing. responsibility. Nigga, your responsibility is you, your family. Exactly. And yeah. in order to make sure me and my family straight, I need that salary. Nigga, you can make your own salary. Yeah, I mean, How you gonna make go, your own salary? By doing you what you don't print the money. You to do. Right, but that that that's the way that's a job. But what I'm telling Whether you, you own your own company or not, I mean, we definitely could go back on to ownership, which is one of the reasons why Jay's so influential. But shit, even if you own your own company, it's still work that got to be done. Oh, yeah, you got to put the work out. So you got to work, yeah, regardless. Gotta Whether you're working for yourself, I, I would I would fucking recommend everybody to work for themselves. But that ain't the reality of the situation. Then, I, then I'm, I'm, I'm damn dash if I say, you a bust, uh, uh, you 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 fucking whack if you don't work for yourself. Yeah, like I can't, I can't. Yeah, yeah that's that's. that's, that's I didn't agree with that. Yeah, one. that's what I'm saying. Like that's that's the part of the like the message that 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 get missed. Like the yeah. good stuff he's saying get missed when he say outlandish shit like that. But I feel like you gotta write the plan down too. But you gotta to get to that. I agree with that. You know, the message, the total message that got missed and, and told and be missed about that all the time is to know that you don't have to do that. You know what I'm saying? It's cool with, okay, if you choose to be a worker, but to have the knowledge to know that you don't have to do that. But that's the knowledge that people need. The fact that the matter is, because a lot of times people don't Somebody gotta be workers. 
Somebody got to be working. True. True. Everybody not going to be a boss. So I don't, I'm not saying that you specifically have to be a worker, mm -hmm. but somebody has to be. Correct. Right. But just know that you don't have to be. That's the whole point. That's what right. I'm telling you. But if you don't want to be you one, start off, if you, you don't, don't want to be one, yeah, if you don't want to be one, you don't have to. Yeah. But that's what I'm telling you. Exactly. In colleges and schools, that's the message that's portrayed. They put you in school, and what you learn in school is the system of being an of employee, mm -hmm. not to be a business owner. And that's and crazy how we you. how we learn because like they don't really teach that shit in school. Like, it depends on what school. It depends. Yeah, plan, but to have a rapper give you the game through his music. Because that's somebody who did it. That's somebody who did it. And that's and that's another thing that I I would say about Jay as far as as far as um the difference in how he started out and what he is now. We saw him go from being being street hustling out here to being an OG. Yeah. And when you're an OG, you're supposed to put the the, the 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 you know the people come up behind you after you're supposed to put them on to something new right. like you ain't supposed to lead them down the wrong way you ain't supposed to be able to you know just just have them doing the same dumb shit you did like I don't want mine to not to be doing the same dumb shit I I done did like at some point in time you gotta gotta give them a little more game right. which transitions into niggas like LeBron who's also influential as a motherfucker like. I ain't a I ain't a LeBron fan as far as his as far as his basketball on the court shit. I ain't a LeBron fan, but off the court, I don't know if anybody fucking with him. Like as far as yeah, what he doing for the problem. community, yeah. <laughs> like as far as how he put his partners on, like school, like like I don't think nobody fucking with him. Period. That, especially yeah. not, especially not in that sports world, but. I'm talking about across lines, like but what I what I done seen do and how he how he controlled every step of his career and how he like how he planned that shit out. And I ain't even saying he did everything right, cause you know there was fucking hiccups along the way. But a nigga got us a yeah, good financial advice. Man, he yeah, had yeah, nigga somebody had, gave him the fucking had, game. Nigga had good everything advised my nigga. First of all, he came in and he got hit with it so early. He had a lot to be able to distinguish from immediately. Niggas hitting him with so much bullshit in 11th grade. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm getting hit with million dollar offers since 11th grade. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, nigga, I, I'm, all I'm doing is just getting polished. You know what I'm saying? For what moves about to be made for the rest of my life. You know, what I, who I'm trying to put well. Who, what type of decisions need to, you know what I'm saying? And it's all the people that's been around me this whole time. Like, why change anything? Like, you know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, man, that nigga influenced. I don't understand. He influenced his peers and generations, so many generations to come, you know what I'm saying? Just as far as how to move, because he changed how niggas can even move in the NBA. So, uh, you know, you know, one thing about LeBron, dog, is how rich that nigga been for how long <laughs> and how young he got rich. And he's still young. Still young. <laughs> still young. Still young. Still but you young. ain't never heard no scandals. Like the microscope been on this nigga since day one. Oh, shit, huh? Like, boy, if that microscope hey, was on me, I'd have been bending for this nigga. Hey, man, you ain't heard about no scandals. The nigga with the same old lady from high school. That's bro. why, and that's why I argue with niggas so hard. Even just about the basketball shit, because That's I feel different. like that, I feel like that shit goes into it. You know what I'm saying? I, I truly feel like that go into the basketball shit. It don't. It do. It gotta be way harder. It gotta be way harder, dog, to be that official off the court, to be that official on the court. Like nigga can't have everything. He does like, like what you think. He he tempted. Like I feel like y'all niggas feel tempted. Yeah. He done. He done fucked up. Yeah. But we'll did. never know. Right. Right, he didn't have scandals or under the table scandal type. I got a little bit of pope on speed dial, bitch. Come on. <laughs> Man, something happened. Something. But when you got that when you got that team around you and 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 you ain't just sold out to the highest bidder, 
You ain't come out and, and, and fucking hire a nigga. Bitch, you came out and rolled with your partners. Bitch, my partners got secrets about me that they gonna hold to their fucking grave. You see what I'm saying? If this was a nigga who I didn't hire, the next nigga might hire him and, 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 and could pay him a little more than not paying him to, to expose those secrets. But when you got your team, you know, sided like that, yeah, we ain't never gonna know that secret. That's true. Yeah, I mean, so yeah, cause he ain't perfect, so I know the nigga that that fell off yeah, or yeah. fucked up. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I mean, everybody, everybody ain't nobody perfect. Nobody so perfect. perfect for me. Everybody gonna always have their little they little thing. It's, it's Whatever about, it is, it's all about how you it, bounce how you bounce back. back. And and that's the thing, though. But for us, to never hit no. Like what was the what was the only scandal nigga heard about in the fucking throwback jerseys in high school? Yeah. Oh yeah. That's it. Ben man was sex sixteen years old then, seventeen years old. Been straight and um and a um, multi like man, homie, nigga gonna man, be homie, 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 homie exceeded day. all the expectations, dog. That's my whole thing. Off the court. On the court also. There's no way in the world niggas would have thought that this man was about to dominate the game the way he did. That's a long time. Man, hell yeah, man. And that shit unprecedented. This is his first. That's not hell unprecedented. Season. It's how. So who the hell who ever did it before? On the court? Who yeah. dominated? Come on, coach. Yeah, like that. Come on, coach. Michael for Jeffrey long. Jordan, nigga. For not for no, not for that long, my nigga. I'm talking about the whole the longevity of everything. Michael Jeffrey. So Jordan, he got six rings. Yeah, he never, never lost the final. He never played in the seventh final. LeBron went to eight of them in a row. Eight in a row. He did go eight in a row, but nigga Jordan went six, one six. You don't get no award for just going. Yeah, you got to go and win that shit. Jordan won six, won three, took a break, came back, won three more. Like, how do you even compare the I'm, two? I'm talking about influence and impact on the, on the game itself, bro. We talking about an eight year span of dominance. Whether he won it or not, you know what I'm saying, there's a difference. So you know what I'm saying, that's another that's another Right, that's talking that's about another discussion, but at the off the court day, dog, I mean we we could, we could go back and forth about this all day. Off the court I'ma have to say LeBron got him, but on the court ain't nobody influenced the game of like Jordan what I mean, LeBron bull twenty three. Yeah, for sure. Like why I'm you never, think I'm he never, bull twenty three? I'm, I'm never trying to slight Slight Jordan impact, my Yeah, you a goddamn yeah. fool. I ain't never trying to slide him, you know. Yeah, ain't no, ain't nobody like you influence. Ain't no sign my shoe, fuck it. Um, well, you probably had the fucking um. No, I had everything. Negative J nine hundred days. Negative. Negative. <laughs> negative. The negative. fucker, you can't tell the difference looking at. Him. Negative. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, shit. That's that's one. But I mean, just based off influence, uh, are big things that. Shit, I mean, you know, uh, that fucking, uh, what was the movie? That Black Panther, that had a big old influence on black culture the past few years. That's, sure did, because everybody was wearing that sheepies and shit, don't even know that it's fucking. They don't, but, but that that I is. Be, I be feeling like influence and impact be kind of different, though. They are. Influence, it ain't influence nobody. It might have influenced the kids, too, you know Yeah, that's saying? the thing, the kids, like, they, they you know. That's the first time seeing a black super. But we, 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 we be with that trendy shit. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Like that yeah, shit is trend. It is that that was trend. That a trend rather than a, a real influential movement. That's true. You know what I'm saying? I agree. That shit was a trend, man. I agree. I agree. But that is, like, I, I, I mean, a lot of this shit I think about as far as influence because, I mean, as adults, we do get influenced, but I really be feeling like that shit is all for the kids. Like, as an adult, like, like by the time you grown, if your family ain't pushing you to be what you need to be, then it's probably over for you. <laughs> know what I'm saying? Like, niggas gonna say certain shit to spark certain ways of thinking. And I mean, certain people can influence how we think and, but I mean, I, I, I. You gotta be willing to be influenced. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of times, depending on what, what you're talking about, you know what I'm saying? If you, a lot of us, we so we such creatures of habit to what it's hard to break that barrier. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's why it'd be kinda hard to get influenced on different you know what I'm saying, something that's different from what you know which was was normal to you. Yeah. Right? That's why they do got these people out here like 
that's that did some influential shit. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, like, yeah, people that didn't really made a, a, a true crater in the fucking, you know what I'm saying, community, whether that's it's true. black, whether whatever genre music that you know what I'm saying, it could be music, it could be sports, you know what I'm saying? Like people that, like Beyonce. I feel like she's another one. Like a lot of these people, we can't keep saying ten years. Like they kind of fall out of the ten year category because they've been doing what they've been doing for all that ten years. But they've been still. But they still doing. They still do making the same moves. You know what I'm saying? Up until present even, day, even bigger moves though. But that's yeah, because the platform yeah, that they. You know what I'm saying? That's because throughout time they, they all they did was become bigger. Yeah, but, you moves, know what I'm saying? The moves the that they making them make them, making the, leading them to be able to make bigger moves. Yeah, you're definitely right about that. You can't slight B, dog. Cause you, you can't. I don't even want to say nothing bad about B on this thing. I don't want to say her breast thing or nothing, cause the oh. fucking beehive will come get it. First yeah, of all, for sure. First of all, I feel like B the coldest performer yeah. that ever touched the yeah. mm. Like that's how yeah. that's how influential I feel about her. I feel like, of course, of course, they got other people that paved the way for her, but her being who she is. Mm. And the way she do it, yeah, it I think she next under Michael Jackson. Though. Niggas was passing like out for Mike. Like you think she can surpass Michael? Yeah, niggas was passing out for Mike. Yeah, I ain't seen nobody flat out faint for Beyonce. That's because you ain't never probably been at all her concerts. I ain't been at all of my songs. I seen, I've seen, I've been to a Beyonce concert. Drive, who, who concert? I've never been to a Michael Jackson concert for sure. But I have been to a Beyonce concert, and that bitch cold. She cold. She up there like I ain't, ain't no hate on her. But I, I don't know if I can put nobody above Mike, though. She, 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 she don't that, 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 that last day she did, she did. That, 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 that last day she did, that homecoming shit. That Coachella, that shit was fine. Yeah, that yeah. shit fine. Like, ain't no, ain't no if, ands, or buts. She coming with it. And she yeah, got, man, she got a cult following. Nigga <laughs> not fucking with her, dog. To do what she do, the way she do it. Mike, even, like, Mike wasn't doing that. Like Mike wasn't doing no, 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 I'm sorry. Man, I'm I, sorry. They, I, I feel like she I'm got sorry. the game from Mike, though. But yeah, you can get the game from somebody, that don't mean, that don't mean you can't be better than them. Man, Beyonce ain't got no, like, Just see, that's, how I see, see, that's the time. thing, that's the thing. And, 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 and a part of that also is, when we get into comparisons, it's almost like, damn, I gotta, I gotta say something bad about one, to show you why the other one better, yeah, and I don't be wanting to do that. And that's a problem, but and that's a problem with with us with black comparison. people because we always gotta compare ourselves yeah, to another black person. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. why you just can't be who you are? But what it's hard about? when you throw shit out there like the best ever. And then, and, then, and, then, and, then, because, so many and that's opinions. because you already feel like they have that already. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. the only reason why you feel like that. It's gonna be hard because you wouldn't you wouldn't feel the way about music, mine music, if you ain't have one. Music period. Like 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 at the end of the day, dog. If if I had to just pick, like nah, Mike, the music, the I feel the dance, I feel like Prince was Mike, Prince, and, 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 uh, like I feel like I Prince. Ain't, I put Prince above Mike. See, I ain't never fuck with Prince like that. I did, Rest in peace, like Prince. But that man was, I'm talking about talented. I'm yeah. talking about talented. But see, it was just Mark certain Cole. shit Prince was doing that I felt like, nah, no nigga ain't supposed to be doing that. Yeah, so that's totally different. I couldn't, I was talking about I couldn't that was, get jiggy with that. All that was entertainment. Yeah, and I don't, I don't know if that was entertainment. Shit. But I don't care about that. I don't care about that. that first of all, that wasn't even my time. You know the ass out like jeans and shit. I, I was, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I caught the the, 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 the other end of that. You know what I'm saying? So, the ass out and all that type of shit, I definitely wasn't a part of that. Yeah, <laughs> nobody was a part of it. <laughs> Nigga definitely wasn't a part of it, but I was just like that. I guess that was kind of my. But I just focused on all that kind of way. I just respect Home and Talent, man. Home was oh, the same as Dan Sam. And Home and knew how to play all the instruments. Man, ain't nobody from Home. Man, man, black Mike was cold, white Mike was cold, little Mike, little Mike, young Mike, got to be there. Nigga, you only heard that song, man. You ain't seen that song. I ain't have to. I seen the video. I seen. Yeah, that nigga was cold. Jackson Five Mike was colder than the real Mike. But that's still Mike. That's still little Mike. Yeah, I ain't talking about. I'm talking about. Nah, you can't. You can't. You can't just cut off half the nigga. He is the coldest performer. I don't know. Ever to touch the planet? I don't know. She's second. <laughs> I'm telling you, she's that second. Might be. Yeah, she, 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 she's she second to me. She's second to me, and she cold just because like, and and I don't want, 
I don't want it to feel like I ain't giving her props because she definitely cool. Like, like the work ethic. The work ethic. She been in hell doing that shit. She fine as a motherfucker. Singing she really singing. Singing upside she down. She's singing though. Like yeah, she's she singing, cold. sounding just like that was, that was what you hear. Yeah, she cold. Like Michael singing Jackson, upside down. Michael like, Jackson like, didn't sing that good. Come on, not dog. dog so you on, like? Man. So you? So you mean to tell me you like fucking? Uh, he's black or white? That was your shit. He's black. <laughs> That's the pop, Mike. You know? Nigga, that's Mike. But, like, uh, but be right. pop. So that's what I'm saying. But we got pop songs that I probably ain't gonna pick over some of the other ones. Like the ones you cross over. Some of them I'm cro- talking about some of them. Skills. Some of them crossover songs ain't gonna get reach us. Like, like, like you know, it was two different eras. I don't really. I mean, shit. I don't want to compare them, dog. Like, I don't want to compare them, dog, because I feel like I'm I'm slighting one. Like they both. They both. Upper echelon in their own in their yeah, own man, way. Nigga ain't listen to Michael Jackson after man, you crazy, world, man. Man, you crazy. So you like the bad and all that? Man, <laughs> yes. Yes. that was your shit. Yes. Yeah, you. Man, 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 Mike Cole, dog. I wasn't fucking with that. What the nigga? Oh, I know that nigga. Yeah, dog. Even the shit with uh, it's world with too. Eddie Murphy in them. Uh, with that Eddie Murphy in the video with the with the Pharaoh. Yeah. Dangerous yeah. and all that. Uh-huh. Smooth criminal, man. Mike Cole, dog. You hate, dog. He and see was that, cold. And, he was cold. Yeah, man. He was cold. Yeah, he was cold. Yeah, he was cold. Yeah, probably in. Pooh was probably in the fucking living room. Go ahead and hit his mama. Pooh going down. Definitely not to that shit. Man. But you would get digging to Pooh. New edition of shit. <laughs> <laughs> them niggas was influential too. Period. And they get this shit from Mike. Them niggas was up. They get this shit from Jackson 5. Them niggas was influential too. They came back with that movie. That fucking that fucking new edition movie had got a whole new generation of uh, kids oh, on that sure. on that Mr. Telephone yeah. man. Nah, boy, that our boy, that Luke, wasn't nothing on there. Held it down. Shout, shout out, out to Luke, Luke man. Mm-hmm. We watched him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, man. I used to I used to damn near get that boy a couple of little. Uh, now you gave lessons. Now you gave him. <laughs> now you put Luke up. He know. Up. <laughs> oh, he know. Nah, he know. He know. He know. He know. He tell you. Yeah. But I mean, overall, I mean, I know it's probably some people we left out. You know, we just was talking about this off camera, really, and decided to bring it on camera. Just about, you know, positive. We 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 want to be positive here at NOP, and we want to give people their roses and, and shout out while while they can still smell them while they can hear. <laughs>